boy hiding with his sister in their bathroom calls 911, what he says to them is just frightening. Is there anything scarier than someone breaking into your house? What about if burglars came into your house and threatened to harm you and your family? Well, that's the exact situation one family found themselves in and it was scary. However, one little boy played the hero as he rescued his little sister from the armed man. When he finally called 911, the dispatched was shocked by what the little boy said. It was a beautiful and sunny day in Norwalk, California. One family was enjoying the day and they were having a relaxed day inside. However, they had no idea what was going to be in store for them that day. The family was enjoying their leisurely day when they suddenly heard a loud crash come from the front of the house. The husband and wife quickly got up to investigate what the noise was. Their young son and daughter were sitting in the other room looking scared too. As the husband and wife made their way to the front of the house they were shocked by what they saw. There were three men standing in the front of their house. They had broken in and that wasn't the worst part. Not only were there three burglars standing in their house, but the men were also armed. The assailants immediately began to threaten the husband and wife. It was incredibly scary situation. The three armed men began to continue to harass the husband and wife. They began throwing out threats and told them that they were going to kill them. The couple's seven-year-old son heard everything play out. The couple's seven-year-old son, Carlos, heard everything as it was happening. He was incredibly scared and worried for his parents, his younger sister, and himself. That's when he decided to do something brave. In the middle of the chaos, the three burglars didn't seem to spot the young boy and his sister. This gave the seven-year-old an unlikely advantage in this situation. The young boy looked around and realized that there was only one logical thing to do in a situation like this. The young boy grabbed his little sister and quickly sprinted over to the bathroom. He locked the door behind him and also made sure to have a telephone with him. It seems that his parents had prepared him for an emergency situation like this one. Carlos then grabbed the phone and quickly dialed 911. A dispatcher by the name of Monique Patino quickly picked up on the other line and asked what the emergency was. That's when Carlos explained what was going on. There's some guy who's going to kill my mom and dad, he said in an exasperated voice. Bring cops. A lot of them. And soldiers, too. As soon as the little boy explained the situation, Monique could hear what sounded like someone breaking into the bathroom. The call was then interrupted by a scream. Monique was absolutely shaken up over the phone call that she had just received. She immediately sent help over to the house. That's when she heard something interesting. That's when Monique heard something crazy on the other end of the line. She heard one of the burglars ask young Carlos who he was. That's when Carlos answered with the best answer ever. As the burglar interrogated the young boy, Carlos quickly gave him the best answer. Who are you? One of the assailants pressed. Carlos responded by saying, 911. That's when something incredible happened. As soon as Carlos alerted the burglar to the fact that he had called 911 everything changed. The burglar quickly headed over to the other two assailants and told them what was happening. That's when the men decide to flee the house. Monique has expressed that this was one of the most horrifying 911 calls she has ever picked up on. She has been a dispatcher for many years and she says that this one has stuck out to her the most. You could hear the fear in the kids' voices, she said. Monique explained that her heart plummeted when she heard the young kids screaming as the assailant approached them. The entire time all she could think about was if it were her own kids. Once I heard the screams, I'm holding the phone and shaking, in tears. All I can hear is them screaming. The family is incredibly fortunate for the way things turned out. After all, it could have ended much worse. The family's lucky ending is all thanks to the bravery of their young son. If not for the brave and educated actions of the seven-year-old boy, this might have ended tragically, said Sheriff's Captain Pat Maxwell. The young boy is a hero and his bravery helped save his life and his entire families. The family is so grateful that nothing worse occurred during that break-in. They are also incredibly proud of their son's quick thinking and his bravery. The couple is thankful that they prepped their son on what to do in the event of an emergency. As you can see, heroes comes in all shapes and sizes. This seven-year-old proved to be a real hero when his family needed him the most.